Hello, before we start, make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell to receive updates when we upload new videos. Keep watching until the end of the video to see the interior shots, exterior shots and the full review. Almost every Audi to wear an RS badge has been an overwhelmingly competent machine, delivering enviable levels of power, poise, tech and luxury. That said, not every one of the German automaker's performance branded models has simultaneously managed to deliver an aesthetic and visceral punch to match their dynamic abilities. Many, especially the company's four-door RS models, have instead adhered to Teddy Roosevelt's oft-quoted foreign policy maxim, speak softly and carry a big stick, like the brand signed some sort of gentleman's decorum agreement. As you can see by the 2020 Audi 7 Rupees Sportback, pictured here, that far more subtle approach is evidently dead and buried. In fact, one look at the front end of this swoopy five-door Grand Torador suggests that not only is that approach dead and buried, it's been subsequently exhumed, pulverized to a fine powder and then combusted inside the RS7's fire-breathing, twin-turbo, 4.0-liter V8. Whereas the outgoing 7 rupees coyly hinted at its power with subtly reworked fascias, discrete badges and unique wheel patterns, the 2027 rupees sportback bellows about it. The new car is a broad-shouldered bully, sporting a radically different and altogether more aggressive look thanks to its unique to RS wide body stance. In truth, the 7 rupees only sports about 1.6 inches of extra width over its A7 and S7 siblings, but visually, it might as well be a foot wider. The 7 rupees shares just its hood, roof, front doors and rear hatch with its siblings. The RS7's biggest appearance change is up front, where it now brandishes a bezel-less, oversized, hexagonal honeycomb grille bookended by a pair of massive intakes that stretch upward toward the car's glowering LED headlamps. In profile, the RS7's trademark teardrop shape boasts the aforementioned blistered fenders, along with model-specific side sills and unique 21 or 22-inch alloy wheels. Outback, a prominent rear diffuser has a bridge element that serves to emphasize the sewer pipe size oval exhaust finishes. Even in shades other than this tester's Tango Red, and without our photo car's optional black optic package, the 7 rupees finally has the visual muscle to stand up to its Volkswagen Group kin, Porsche's Panamera Turbo, as well as rivals like the Mercedes AMG GT four-door and the forthcoming BMW M8 Grand Coupe. Some buyers may prefer the outgoing RS7's more reserved appearance, but Audi says owners and cross-shoppers alike have been vocal in seeking more visual aggression and greater differentiation from lesser familial models. It's hard to fault that logic, especially when the 7 rupees is likely to cost around $50,000 more than a base A7 when it arrives in dealers. That snarling and taut new bodywork isn't an empty promise. The RS7's 4.0-litre, TFSI twin-turbo V8 produces 592 horsepower and 590 pound-feet of torque routed through an 8-speed paddle shift automatic transmission and rear-biased quattro all-wheel drive. Interestingly, the exiting 7 rupees performance model's 4.0 featured slightly more horsepower, 605, but substantially less torque, 553 pound-feet. Of course, there could be incrementally higher performance 7 rupees models yet to come, but either way, it's awfully hard to find a place to deploy this kind of firepower in public. Fortunately, I had a better shot at than most, as at the test drive event, Audi let me loose on both de-restricted sections of Germany's famed Autobahn as well as on some surprisingly challenging mountain roads just hours after the car debuted at the Frankfurt Motor Show. Audi says the new 7 rupees Sportback will hit 62 miles per hour in in 3.6 seconds and power onto a top speed of at least 155 miles per hour. An optional dynamic package relaxes the limiter out to 174 miles per hour, and the dynamic plus pack pushes the total to 190 miles per hour. If anything, Audi may be slightly underselling this car's acceleration. When the traffic clears, thrust from the V8 is immediate, linear and monstrous, with peak torque kicking in from just 2,050 revolutions per minute. 
On speed limit free sections of the autobahn, the 7 rupees is hilariously quick to achieve velocities you'd otherwise only explore on a racetrack, doing so with rock solid stability and surprisingly little wind noise.
Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video. Subscribe to Auto TV.